curiosity. I want to see somebody who hasn't lost their, ooh, you know, what about that? When they're looking at the choreography or when I'm directing them, I want them to stay curious. People who think they know everything are the worst. I want their technique, that they should have a good base, right? They should know what they're doing. But in terms of the art side of it, it's like every time you walk into a new ballet, it's, it's completely new. You're a beginner again. And I feel that as a choreographer of like, this is a totally different story. It's a totally different set of characters. It's a new journey. And so yes, you bring in some expertise, but you also have to be really open to it. And I think for me, I try not to get in my head about it when I'm making a ballet. I just kind of walk in, I'm like, okay, hey, let's make a ballet. That first day actually that we choreograph, I always tell the dancers, I'm like, our first day is like the free square on the bingo card. If we make stuff and we just think it's all terrible, we're gonna throw it out. You know, no pressure. Day one is just getting in the studio, getting curious, getting creative, you know, whatever it is. And because of that ability to stay curious, those artists are then able to kind of find a lot deeper, more authentic work than if they come into something like, oh, this is how I play this character, this is how I do this. That to me can feel real stagey. And that's something I'm always trying to get away from. Mm -hmm.